today lecture i'm going to discuss what how to create simple ssrs report with visual studio 2022 so let's open the visual studio 2022 now there after here we need to create new project and this place you need to search reporting so there are two reporting go or services are there first is you can create the project with the wizard and without wizard this is empty so i'm going to select this option after that click next then or give here project name employee report then after you need to click on this create button so project then after here you can see this is the wizard that open you can click next or uh, then here you can see new data source and this is here this is the name of the data source and from here you can select the data source so that can be microsoft sql server there you can use uh, oracle enter data and other option here i am going to use microsoft sql server then after you need to click on this edit so since i am going to use the local system so here giving the server name local host then you can provide to authentication either windows or sql so if i give sql server authentication you need to give the username and the password from here it will directly comes to your sql server then you can see this all database that available so going to select a json and then after selecting click on this test now there after you need to click on this okay there after next and there you need to specify the username and the password for the data source one so giving sa and give the password after that click on okay then here go to query builder then or select a start from so you have confusion what exactly tables inside there so for this one that i'm going to open the ssms microsoft sql server management studios so from there you can easily identify tables views a store processor from there you can easily get that okay now let's uh, click not this one i did the mistakes so go on the database then here give the password and press enter then from here you can see this is the json and inside the json there are or three tables are there so select top 1000 then this is the department and to uh, this all those things so let's uh, use here select uh, a store from departments and there after if you give all those things correct click on this okay then automatically it's taken all the columns from the department there after if you go back on the query builder then you can see or oh, this is the department has the four columns and or oh, this is here tables and oh, that's all fine click okay then next so you can select from here tableau or matrix so matrix this is design and this is the tableau design so both can be fine there after you need to click on this next so this display field so i'm going to use the uh, this display field so this is for page and making the group on the department id and this for details 
these two sport details okay it should look like this after that click on this next then here you can use this step this is block okay and include so here this is steps you can use any one of these tools so i think uh, this so uh, step is looking better then you need to click on this next and thereafter give here or the name of report employee details and their report employee details report thereafter click on this finish now your report the first simple report that created then after that uh, here you can see if you want then you can see the preview data so if you click on this preview data thereafter there you can see this is username and the password for data source you need to provide first so giving the username and the password after that click on this view report so this is loading first section is for accounting this is id this is manager id location id so this is the first row if you want to second row then this is the second row administrator third row fourth row and fifth row after that this is now preview if you want to do the deployment so you need to click on this uh, start so here you can see this is now deployed there is succeed and there is no any problem after that uh, the next is you need to copy this location and uh, thereafter let's open or there any of your favorite browser open paste and press enter then you can see employee report is there you need to click this employee details report that i just created on this state click on this then first you need to specify the username and the password then if that all correct then you can see this is the employee details report on the browser so here from uh, you can see the next row of this report and uh, here this is the zoom version 50 percent and if you want to make that 150 this is looking bigger and there export data menu so you can this export into excel powerpoint pdf this all format whatever you want then you can export that okay so this is how we can uh, create simple ssr report using visual studio 2022 so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you